Hey, what's up guys? It's Chris from sellmorenewhomes.net and gotrealestateleads.com. I want to talk to you today about a strategy, one of the strategies that we include as part of our program. Um, it's called curating content, but I want to talk to you about a little bit more of a uh, specific strategy inside of uh, curating content to your pages called newsjacking. I want to tell you a little bit of a story about what I've done and, and some of the results that we've seen from it. So, newsjacking is a strategy that we use as part of our Facebook lead ad strategy inside of an overall larger strategy that's called curating content. So when you go and you set up your page, you know, we set these pages up, they've got regional feels to them. Uh, my page is Best Davis and Weber County Homes that we use. My wife's, that's for my, my personal real estate business inside of Ogden, Weber, um, Weber County, Davis County, where I get all my sales. My wife's that we use for new construction is Utah Quick, New construction quick move-ins. So you always got this regional flavor and this regional flair. So that lends itself really well and really nicely to curating content. So when we look at, so what basically you're gonna do, when you start your first page, and I teach this, we break this down in our system at what you do, but you go and you find a bunch of different news uh, stories um, that are going on in your community and you post them to your page because you want your page to appear as if it is a, a place people can go for information, uh, of what's going on in the local market and that's really what you want to be you're just there to provide information um, and get to into a relationship with these people where you're providing them uh, information that they need so we take news jacking here's how it's gonna work you're gonna look in the local news and you know, jack those stories and you're gonna provide a solution for people so basically here's what you're gonna do go on your go in your Google search bar or whatever search engine you use and you're gonna search for local real estate news find a story that pops up in there and you're gonna share it on your page. So what I found this morning was a story about how unaffordable housing has become for first time buyers in Utah. Uh, it might be the same way in your area, but whatever it is, you know, maybe it's, um, uh, maybe it's new, new programs that they've released as far as grants and those kinds of things. And I'm actually gonna show you how we do that on Tuesday in our mastermind if you're interested in that as well. Another strategy we teach. Um, but it could really be anything, okay? So what I did is I found this story, I posted it, it's from a local, uh, it's from Deseret News, or Salt Lake Tribune, I think it was here in Utah. I posted it to our page and I said, man, getting your, qualifying for a new home as a first time buyer can be kind of a stretch. Luckily, there's several different grant programs out there that provide first time buyer uh, down payment assistance, all the different kind of systems, different kind of programs that there are out there. Message us for for details and information. So that's simple, um, and you know you get leads from that just like that, and that doesn't cost you anything. That's not a boosted post or anything like that. You can boost that post. That's probably the only time I would ever recommend boosting a post is with something like this. And you definitely don't want to do that. You, you know the, the best way to do that is to provide have them message you. Uh, start that conversation again. Conversations create closing, and we're there just to create conversations and get the conversation started. Because then, what will what will what will we know about that person? We'll know that they're interested in real estate, and that they're on our page and they've reached out to us. And that's a really good prospect. That's somebody you can put into your funnel and continue to market to. So basically, with the news story, you're going to find a problem. So mine was unaffordability in first-time buyers. You're going to agitate it with the story. I'm sure they're going to go, that story's long-winded about, oh my God, it's so difficult to buy a house, blah, 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 blah. Credit scores and down payments and blah, blah, blah. So you're agitating with the story, okay? And then you're providing a solution, which is, hey, message me and I'll get you some information on how, it can, how we can fix this for you. Hey, here's the deal. I'm going to go ahead and attach this below here um, and put this on our Facebook Lead Ads page, Lead Ads Mastery page. Um, if you haven't joined that page yet, head on over there. Now we provide a ton of good free content all the time to help you sell more new homes. And of course, we always have our free 10-day trial uh, with the entire system at sellmorenewhomes.net. Hey, look forward to seeing you guys. Thanks for spending a little bit of time with me this morning. And go find some news and practice newsjacking. See you later.